Hi guys, it's Olivia here from Olivia's Catastrophe and I'm here to give you the top six reasons why the hype is real and you should definitely be reading The Seven Husbands of Evelyn Hugo by Taylor Jenkins Reid. So this book follows Evelyn Hugo who is this famous Hollywood like superstar actress and she never does interviews with anybody and everybody wonders why she's going to be giving away all of these really famous dresses of her all of a sudden and selling them for charity. However, Evelyn also decides that she's going to do a full spoilery interview talking about her whole life story and for this interview she has selected this little journalist that nobody really knows and this journalist doesn't even know why Evelyn Hugo has chosen her so she goes to meet Evelyn Hugo, here's her life story and maybe we get to know why she was specifically chosen for this interview. Guys, this book was amazing and it's an absolute new favourite of mine and I cannot wait to tell you why you should be reading this. So the first thing that I just want to say about this book is that it is so so well crafted and very well written. You know that this author knows how to write. It's a character driven novel but there is a plot in this one and there is a lot of suspense building up to things and the author knows how to drop hints, how to tell you too much or too little to keep you engaged and just really wanting to know what has happened in Evelyn Hugo's life. I just think that the author really knew how to play with our emotions, play with what we thought and she was really guiding us through this story and yeah I just think it was such a well written novel. The second reason moving on is the characters. The characters are so realistic. I have a friend who read this from Instagram and she actually thought Evelyn Hugo was a real person and this was like non-fiction. That's how realistic these characters are and Evelyn Hugo kind of fits into the grey area. You don't know if you love her, you don't know if you hate her but regardless you will still be engrossed and wanting to read more about her and it's not only Evelyn Hugo, all of these secondary characters are fleshed out and are in full detail. I remember that I buddy read this one with Jade from Jaded Reader and we kind of mentioned how we wanted all these spin-off stories following the storyline of all these secondary characters and we literally named nearly all of them because they are all so interesting and they all literally jump off the page and come to life. The third reason why you should read this one is because it has a very interesting take on the Hollywood actress kind of lifestyle. There's a lot that we know about it from magazines and just all of the like drama and gossip that you hear but there's also a lot that you don't really know about the ins and outs of how difficult it can be to always be staying trendy, to be staying on top of things, how quick the game can change and even though some of these things are things that I knew, like subconsciously knew, it just kind of threw it in my face how brutal this world could be. So it's very interesting to get a snapshot of the Hollywood life. Speaking of, the next reason why you should read this book is because it is historical fiction. I think people tend to forget mentioning that because this one is set in the past but not too much of the past. Of course there are ties to today and this present day and your parents might have been alive back then but it's still going across some of these moments in history that were quite important for American history. Some of them I didn't know and I had to look into myself but yeah it does delve into these and it's very important to remember that this is historical fiction. Another reason why you should read this one is because it's got so much rep. There's biracial and black rep, there is Latinx rep and there is also LGBT plus rep but it's not just like oh here's the rep let's throw it in. No they kind of unpack and discuss all of these things but not in a way where the characters are having discussions, well maybe in some cases, but in a lot of cases it's just embedded and included into the story and it's not like the main point of the story because the story has a lot to offer you. But I liked how it was mentioned and brought into things and as well as that the last reason why you should read this book is because it has such an interesting take on the themes of love and marriage. Of course you are reading this because Evelyn Hugo has had seven husbands and you want to know why she's had seven husbands but there's a lot more to all of her marriages and all of her like love stories if you want to call them that so I just thought it was very interesting to see how love can be shown in so many different ways, how marriage can be done in so many different ways and you really do get to see this one in this book. To read this book it's so good like even though the hype is so real it is just so 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 worth it. Okay that's all I have for you guys today I hope you enjoyed watching this review please let me know in the comment section down below if you are scared when a book has a lot of hype or if that makes you even more excited to read it. Generally it scares me because I'm a scaredy cat. Okay thank you please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it hit the subscribe button if you want to see more and don't forget hit the notification bell every time I have a new video and I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye!